Texas is no stranger to the harsh realities of illegal immigration. Each year, countless die making the perilous crossing. Some have even been dumped in mass graves here. Sunday's events in which 10 immigrants were found dead in the back of a sweltering truck are another stark reminder of the risks many are willing to take. There were security cameras outside of Walmart that saw some cars coming in and picking people up. Community organizer Bobby Hurtado says people here are angry about what happened, but no, it won't end. Immigrants try to cross the border every single day. They're just not caught, right? Um, immigrants die trying to cross the border every single day. This is not isolated. This is, wasn't a one-time thing. It happens every single day, and it's not going to stop. The driver of the truck, James Bradley, has been charged with knowingly transporting illegal aliens and now could face the death penalty. Politicians have made promises to tackle human traffickers, but for some undocumented workers, there's little hope of meaningful immigration reform. With Trump, I really doubt something is going to change. It's going to take something really major, bigger than what happened, which, I mean, this was already big for there to be a change in the way that things are handled. Officials call this tragedy a crime against humanity, but it's doubtful the smugglers will face justice or be stopped. Earlier this month, the National Border Patrol Council president called the drop in illegal immigration at the U.S. border miraculous. And according to official figures, the number of arrests has fallen by more than 50 percent. But advocates say those who risk everything for a better life here have little to lose. And the expectation is they'll keep trying no matter what the cost. Adi Gallagher, Al Jazeera, San Antonio, Texas.